who's ready to get your fill of risk? I'm Phil, my top grandmaster playing risk global domination. On my channel, we talk strategy. So for tips, tricks, and techniques, subscribe and follow. Good old classic fixed. Today we are playing uh, fixed, just the regular settings. Alliance is on. We do neutral bot, no fog, no blizzards. Um, I think I roll my three. Oh, they don't let me roll the three. I am going to want add one here because I think I can save that one. And that's probably where I'm going to attack. And then I have four to the two on the four. So now I have two bigger stacks that are less likely to be hit. Okay, so what did blue do on their first turn? Let's go back and look. They stacked into the Middle East. I need to be allies with Blue, because Blue wants Africa, I think, and Africa is right next to me. Okay, White, I don't necessarily need to be allies with at this moment. And Purple is going for South America. Red could force their way into... Europe or North America. White actually had a really good North America play. Okay. We'll see how this goes. Got a cavalry. It's Indonesia, so I'm not going to get a plus two. All right. Okay, so let's see what red wants. What do we think red's going to want? I think red should go to North America. I don't think this is their play. They could fortify the 7 onto the 4. I don't know what I'd do if they fortify the other way. Okay, so they want Australia. Sweet. So I think my next move is to hit Ukraine and move the five in in hopes that green gets out. Green's also going for Africa. So blue's without. I like that hit. That trapped troops, I like that hit. I think white hits me this turn. If not, I roll the three. So they just claimed Africa. So blue didn't quite claim Africa. Blue made kind of a neutral play, even though they moved towards Africa. They showed me that they want Africa. So if I'm blue, I'm probably adding one here and attacking up and over. I'm not doing this. Whatever this, whatever this is, I'm probably not doing this. I would have probably gotten out of Africa on that turn. They could have added troops there, but then gotten out. Okay, so my three in North America is blocked. That move doesn't tell me they're, like, horrible or anything. Okay, so they hit blue. I'm going to leave here. Fortify to the middle. I hope that everybody gets out. If I'm red, what am I doing? I'm adding one, attacking over, coming here. If I'm red and I want Australia. But I don't want Australia. I want Europe. And I'm in no hurry. I don't have a way to pay off if these guys like do stupid stuff to each other. But white didn't add to Australia. Where did they... they got out of South America instead. I don't think hitting a three was the best thing. So I don't I think they're kind of newer with their math at least. They add six here and move it over instead. Okay. I don't know. What do you do if you're white after you've cl claimed Australia? You make a you hit a one, which they don't have. Green's a homie. You're a homie. I liked that move, so I sent you an alliance.
It'd be great to have a nice quick game. I haven't had one in Classic Fix for a while. I'm not strong enough to take this yet. Blue's showing me they're going through, which is fine. I understand what you're doing. It's all good. Yep, I understand. Okay, if I'm white, I would have maybe sat there. Because it's unlikely that I hit them, right? Blue, by hitting twice, they showed me that they were leaving and not staying. So I think blue is kind of good. Steve for Chris, 333. And they abandoned Africa when Africa wasn't working out. They're going to do a long play for uh, North America instead. Purple slowly took South America. I don't hate this. Maybe the five on the four. I would, mm, yeah, maybe. And then the three on the seven, probably. You don't leave the three. That's fine, too. That's fine, too. It's not. I don't see anything bad out of purple yet. We definitely think red is going to take Australia. It's just a matter of when they do it. I don't have cards. I'm not taking this continent until I have cards. Did they manual roll it? It looks like they manual rolled this. So they know to manual roll. Move the two onto the 17. That was the right place to hit. Going over for Australia when someone added troops in there on the first turn was a wrong decision. But from there, they also could have fortified into North America. So it wasn't crazy if they were foreshadowing that move. Now I can bring my four, my three over, add one, bring it over, add one, you know, I can bring it over and try not to lose troops. Good luck in your FFA game, Carlza. I've been playing a ton of auto match recently and it's a nice lesson in patience. It's just really a matter of time to win auto match games. Don't make anyone mad. Don't get too greedy and you can almost always win. Yes. They lost one on that. That's too bad. If I had a trade... Ooh, that's nice. If they move on to the 6, I'll move my 3 out. I'll add a couple to it. And go boom, boom. Instead. Okay. Okay. That was a nice move. I'm moving my 3 out for them. And I'm doing it in one turn to be homie. This is the wrong move from white. Adding more to Australia is the wrong move. Because... Red looks crazy. I'll catch up on my chat here in a second. Yep, even if the Yoder says, even if the the strongest the other players will self-destruct into each other exactly and what's up jolie how you doing i'm doing good i'm in the troop lead just by being conservative even over blue who traded they're leaving troops in north america okay let's see if red does this now do i have a trade I have a bad trade. Am I in danger of dying? Who can kill me? Red can kill me with a trade. It's not a bad idea. White cannot. Blue already traded. Green. 
It's a hard kill. So red would have to add troops here, here, and here, and come through and get good rolls. Do I risk having five cards? Do I risk having five cards? Red probably backdoors me. They're a noob. Okay. I don't see being able to kill white. I have 32 troops. I'm going to risk it. Those might be my famous last words. And I got a wild, so I got a big trade out of it. If if I can hold if I can hold. I definitely wasn't taking it because that would have put eyes on me. Taking it mean taking Europe. I don't really want to kill any people right now because they're all at like 20 some troops and there's there's splits like red's probably the easiest to kill if they don't trade they're trying to kill white they're trying to kill white then green goes and then blue goes then I go Man, this is a hard kill, man. If it works out, though, if it works out... Oh, 14, there's... I don't think they counted. I don't think they counted. Oh, man, I don't think they counted. Don't tell me they get this kill. This is insane. Don't tell me they get this kill. They're going to get a double trade off of it. They have to roll a 2v1. Oh, and then green gets those cards. Green gets five cards from it. Green can probably kill... Oh, man. I should have traded. Green can probably kill... I mean, they might be able to just straight up win the game. They kill white. Green should kill white. Kill red. Kill me? I'm going to go take Australia. White, White's going to trade? This doesn't make sense. Maybe still kill White? Still kill White and Red? Go take Australia? They're trying. Now White trades. What do they do with their trade? Four? You need like nine here. They're gonna have three cards and maybe oh man, they have almost no troops. I get their I get their three cards. Are they a bot? No, they're not a bot. I'm gonna add like nine here and I'm gonna go for the double kill. And I'm gonna get a ton of cards out of it. Maybe maybe ten here?
Can I triple kill? I don't think so. Oh, I got... I'm on China. I, yeah, I can't triple kill. We're going to slam it. <laughs> Look at these cards, man. Um... I'm going to go here with my army, because we got almost a... We got almost a game that's over. We have almost a game that's over. I can kill blue. And be in a three-player endgame. If blue doesn't have cards. I don't know if being conservative is the right move here. What do I have for a trade? I still have a bad trade. Ugh. I still think I can kill blue, though. Bird LASIK. Defiance in South Europe is real. Question question for my YouTube comments. What do you like about Risk? What is your favorite parts of Risk? He's doing this because he can. Stop it, he says. I'm sorry, Blue, but you die next. My favorite part of Risk is probably the psychological aspect of it. That was the only continent I held, dude. And I have five cards. Blue traded. That's fine. I don't care. You're gonna hit my six? You're gonna take Europe. That's fine. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Okay, so he just made a best friend. Do I work with him? I'm way up on green. Where do I go? Green could have cards. I have a block stack, though. So if green comes into me again, I might be able to kill them. Give this guy a thumbs up. I'm using an alliance to help me win a game. Yeah, that was crazy. Our alliance is over. You should bring your 29 out, probably. Yeah. The defense in Southern Europe is real. He 
He trades for 10. He comes into me. Well, he might he might get to beat me because I I made that attack. Do you really want to slam my 21? Are you done with the game? I bring my four in, I think. I'm still in good shape here. We still have a game. All right. Southern Europe defended three. We went twice. I didn't know that. I'm going to keep the block stack. Move out of here. Move this in. I may trade up to North America at some point. I'm just going to bring these things in and stay blocked for now. At some point in time, I want my troops to be activated. Make an alliance with Aaron. I don't want nothing to do with you, dude. Do I trade? I don't think I have to trade here. They hit my two. That's what I would hit. Or the one. You could also break blue, but you might die. Hmm. Good game, he says. I need to get my troops out. Yeah, he kills him. Doesn't have cards. I trade and get my troops out. Do I have to hit pur purple? Well played. What if purple kills blue? What if purple kills blue? What if purple kills me? It's a hard kill. It's not the right time to be in Australia. To be trapped in Australia. Because if purple killed blue, they could four continent endgame me and probably win the game. Now they kill blue and we have a game. Because they're going to have a small stack by the time they hit me. They should hit my one on the way by, probably. Well, they're not fast enough. It looks like they're hitting only blue. Are they fast enough to do this? I think they're going to run out of time. Attack purple. I'll help you beat them. No. Oh, you die. Okay. They get a timer reset. All right, well, we'll see if they're good enough to beat me. They should slam my stack, probably. They should break Australia and slam my stack with this trade. They can't kill me with this trade, but they could get the advantage pretty hard. 11 there? They are not going to... What are they doing?
I'm gonna hit their stack. I'm gonna hit their stack and then take a lot of territories. Eighteen. I think I leave. I think I leave those troops blocked. There, they have 11 territories. They, they're they going to have cards before me. This is an interesting one. I gave them two extra troops because I didn't want to hit a 4 or 5, unlocking a 4 or 5. I have a big trade. Oh, baby, I have a big trade. They're going to hit, and I'm going to counter. Basically, I think I let them have two extra troops until... They're trying to decide what's best to do. I would take Africa. I'd go through Europe taking Africa and then go into Australia. Let's see if they figure that out right now. No, they left Australia. This is a GG's, I think. I think I'm going to win this one. Japan or Greenland? Doesn't matter. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. Fortify here. Then they can't do much of anything. Okay, let's hope this works out. I actually forgot to check. Um... Check this out. They probably break. They now they have to choose. How are they going to break Europe and Asia? Roll a six v six. Oh, I can't believe that worked for them. I can't believe that worked for them. I'm going to get a ton of troops though. Yeah, you need to move troops out. All of them. Okay, now I think I just go slammy slammy. I think I break them now. Now that they've brought troops out. They have three cards, but I don't I don't know how they could come back from this. Good game. I think they're bodying out. They see me rolling. My P dice. Rushing them. We're getting a little bit risky. Got the game one. He should have attacked more when he got down to the 1v1. He should have broken me, taken a bunch of territories. That should be what he should have done. Should have probably taken a bunch of territories, slammed my stack, and broken me all at once. One, two, three, four, five. They're bodied. I wonder why... Okay, so 11, 12. One like. Mm, it's going to take two turns. 
We'll put 15 here just to see if we can get it in this turn. Oh, we won't get it in this turn. And plus, I'm not slidering. Oh, maybe we will. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I don't know if we'll see anybody high rank. Let's see. White was a master. Beginner, beginner. Okay, so White, I think, should have abandoned South America completely and just built a stack elsewhere and looked for opportunities. Subscribe and follow.